The potential of the coronavirus getting into the classroom, prompting the Milwaukee Public School District to start the school year remotely. To help ensure success, a local foundation helped ensure that every MPS student had laptop and internet access. But as Fox 6's Derricka Williams learned, more support is still needed. Attending another school day at home. A first grader at Greenfield Bilingual School, Sofia Ramirez uses a Chromebook for remote learning. For the most part, it's um pretty good. But her mother, Maria Rodriguez, says they've encountered a few challenges. I think the main thing that I'm concerned is about the internet. You know, so many parents are trying to get to the in the in the internet, so sometimes. We have to log in and then come back. With about 75,000 students and more than 5,000 teachers in the district participating in distance learning, providing technology support is a major task. You've got to be able to be both enabled and empowered. Wendell Willis, executive director of the Milwaukee Public Schools Foundation, says the organization is launching phase two of its Connect Milwaukee campaign. We're really deepening our commitment to making sure that technology and online learning is at the highest level it can be. Providing different levels of support and resources. At times we've been talking about do we get different devices, right, whether it be uh, a higher powered laptop, because that laptop may not be conducive to actually doing artwork on that device or doing music work on that device. So we've got to try to be as malleable as possible. Phase two will fund tech support for online learning platforms, additional training and coaching for teachers, personalized support to students and families, additional help desk support staff for parents, along with additional IT staff. I think it's just awesome that school and the foundation are doing this for the kids because they really need it for sure. In Milwaukee, Derricka Williams, Fox 6 News. So far, phase two is at $50,000 and it's hoping to get to 1 million by November 1st. Head on over to fox6now.com or use your Fox 6 News app for a link where you can donate if you'd like.